Hello everyone and welcome. I have designed this little toolbox and printed the pieces on my FDN printer in black and red. Uh, if you don't have an FDM printer, I am really sorry about the video today, but this is what we're going to do. So first of all, I am gluing these small pieces here on the top lid, just uh, with a tiny bit of a super glue, just like that. So that part is quite easy. Just press them good in place and let them dry all up. This little part of the uh, toolbox and then the lid goes on top of the toolbox. This connection needs to be pushed and then everything works. Depending on how your 3D printer is set up and the clearance it has, it can be quite hard to push together or it might be too easy. Uh, in that case, I'm sorry about it. I'm using a piano wire here and cutting off a piece that fits the length here of this little room. Just cutting it off and then I am making sure it fits in the length so that I don't have anything that peeks out in the other side or in the middle room and I'm making two of these. Then I make sure that these little pieces of wire goes uh, all the way through the small lids here. And I'm just placing the lid and pushing the wire all the way through. This, <laughs> this can be a tiny bit tricky to do, but the result is really awesome. And I finally got it to sit in place where I wanted it. Then I am taking a tiny bit of my super glue gel and just popping it into the little hole where the wire goes in to make sure it will stay in there. And I'm doing all this again, but in the other side. And I'm gluing this little uh, wire in place as well. Then it is time for the handle that is just uh, clicked in here and again according to the setting on your 3D printer. It might be hard or it might be as easy as it is here for me. And it should be going freely just like you see it is here. So now we have these two small compartments right here. All done. You can open up the little toolbox and take out the little tray and put in all your tools or what you want to use it for. But that's all there is for this little print. I made it in the opposite colors as well. Anyway, I will link the um, 3D print file in the info box below so you can find it. And for everyone else that don't have a 3D printer, there will be something else tomorrow to you guys. So anyway, thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. So happy crafting.